Everybody in here is the CEO of yourself. Everybody. Because you are the boss of you. It's up to you to be successful. It's up to you to first, first be, to be the first person to believe in yourself. It's up to you. It ain't up to mama, it ain't up to daddy, it ain't up to boyfriend, girlfriend, or whoever. It's up to you. Let me ask you another question. How many people here got a cell phone? Everybody got a cell phone. Everybody got a cell phone. Y'all got some, but y'all got some iPhones, some Samsungs, and all that stuff. Let me ask you a question. What if somebody came in here and took that cell phone and ran up out of you with it? What would you do? Hey, y'all ready to fight already? Look at you. You ready to throw down for a cell phone? Boy, he's like, <laughs> and, and no disrespect, I understand. If somebody takes something from you, you want to get it back. You're like, that's disrespectful. You disrespected me. You don't come take my cell phone. What's wrong with you? Right? You're going to go down and beat them down. But let me ask you this. You'll chase somebody down for a cell phone in which you can find another one. Some of y'all may have insurance, so you can get your contacts and all that other stuff back. But some of y'all won't chase down somebody who's taking your dream, though. You won't chase down somebody who's taking your opportunity. You're not chasing down somebody for the next opportunity to put you where you want to be. See, one of the things that I work in education, I've been working in education for a long time. Before I did that, I was in broadcast news. So I see stuff every day where people didn't go chase their opportunity. I come across people who are older than me, who are younger than me, and the first thing they come to me when they talk about education is, I'm ready to change my life. They're ready to change your life. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not going to pretend to understand everything that you've been through. I'm not going to pretend that I have all the answers. But I, what I will say is that what I'm going to tell you today will help you to get to where you want to be. And the first way you can do that is that everybody in here has to understand what is your worth? What is your why? Why do you do the things that you do? See, we didn't get to choose a lot of things in our lives. But what I am telling you today is that you get to choose the path that you want to take. Because, ladies and gentlemen, there's nobody on the planet. When you look at, I don't care who you look up to, but even these people here on these walls. So when you, before you guys came here, I looked at all these different people. And everybody in here has been through something. Everybody. Nobody has a perfect life. Even if you take the person that you think has a perfect life, their life ain't that perfect. It isn't. So just like I tell anybody, what you gonna do? Are you gonna sit there and let this opportunity slide by? Are you gonna sit there and when 20 years down the line, you gonna tell somebody, I wish I would've did this? Cause trust me, people say it every day. The place that has the most talent on the planet is a cemetery. It's a cemetery. Look how many people died never fulfilling any goals, any dreams, none of their abilities, because they wanted to kick it. I ain't got nothing against kicking it, but take care of the business. 